A few days ago, I stumbled upon a post on Reddit where some student in some college, game development college, was asking about our websites like Stack Overflow, Game Dev Stack Exchange, and we can throw in Unreal forums or Unreal answers and questions, Unity answers as well in there. Are these websites good? He asked that his college teacher or the college teacher started asking, talking about that. I'm not sure, but anyways, that college teacher, whoever, professor, whatever you want to call him, he started bashing people. He was like, oh, these websites are bad. If you want to be a de developer, don't go on those websites, especially if you want to be a good de developer, don't go on these websites because his philosophy is the following. If good developers, they're too busy because good developers have jobs, they work on projects, and they're too busy to write answers on these websites. I cannot say this without laughing. <laughs> and the only people who are on those websites writing answers are people who, you know, have nothing to do, they're bored, they don't have jobs, nobody wants to hire them, they don't know what they're doing, they're not good coders, and these are the people who answer those questions. <laughs> this is exactly why I say people do not go to college. If you want to be a game developer, if you want to be a programmer, if you want to be a doctor and you need that di diploma, by all means, go on college, that's on you. But if you want to be a game developer, programmer in general, do not go in college. And this is the one of the reasons why. First of all, it takes four years to learn from people like this professor who has no idea what real world game development, what real world development is. If you watch any interview with a software engineer, and I'm talking about seniors, people in the industry for 10, 15, 20, whatever years, seniors in game development, every single one of them is going to mention that the main thing that you need to know is how to use Stack Overflow. That's the main thing because your number one goal as a game developer, as a programmer in general, is to do the task, finish the task, solve the problem as fast as you can. And for that, you need to you need resources because there is a high chance that somebody else in the world somewhere had the same problem as you and he solved it and he posed that on Stack Overflow or Game Dev Stack Exchange. So why not go there, see the example, pull it in your own project and change it or whatever, whatever you're gonna do, test it out and you have a solution ready. Instead of you thinking about the solution, reinventing the wheel, the wheel and trying to, you know, come up with things on your own. It takes a lot of time, yada, yada, yada. So this is one of, this is what I'm telling my students in Game Dev Pro. One of the main skills that you need to have is your ability to find answers on Google. And I'm saying Google, but on Google, you're going to discover these answers on Stack Overflow, Game Dev Stack Exchange, Unity Answers, Unreal, en Unreal Engine Forum, depending on which engine you're using and all of that stuff. But the important thing is that you need to know, and this is a skill, how to ask a question, how to find a question, how to filter good questions versus bad questions, how to, you know, get answers from that, put them in your own project, test them and all of that stuff. That's a skill on, on its own. And the more you practice it, the better you will be. And this is mandatory. If you want to get hired in a game studio, this is mandatory. In fact, I will put this on my resume. I will put this in my resume telling I'm very good at finding answers for problems on Google, you know? And of course, you need to be skilled to know how to solve these problems on your own. That's a must, that's, you know, it's there. It needs to be there. The second thing is for you to be able to find answers on Google. And this is what makes a good developer. Now, this is not 1950s, 60s, where developers came up with solutions on their own and blah, blah, blah. So you need to follow this. Otherwise, people who do, who are good at this, are going to eat you and you're not going to get jobs. And these college people, the people who went to college, like the dude who posted this answer, they're going to have a hard time beating people who are doing this. And this is because professors like the one that, you know, told him that people who never had real world experience with a project outside of the books that he's teaching. So yeah, that's my two cents. Learn how to use Google, learn how to use all of that because it, it will be useful for you when you get a job in a game studio. Otherwise, you will not even get a job in a game studio. So yeah.